my bathroom. So like a little bathroom tour. First thing up, yes, I'm keeping it real. My dogs have a water bowl in the bathroom and I put a towel underneath it because I don't want water everywhere. In the middle of the night, they just get off the bed and come in here. Then they go right back to bed. Um, the one thing I love to make, I have a very small bathroom. So I have ceiling to floor shower curtains. I love those. It makes my bathroom feel humongous. My next big thing that I love in my bathroom is my chalkboard. Um, I bought this years ago at Target. It was a picture frame. So I just um, bought a can, a spray paint, of chalkboard spray paint and um, sprayed it on there and the frame was already black. It was no big deal. And people always say, well, why do you have a chalkboard in your bathroom? When I don't put like cute little sayings on it like this, I always write down what I need. Toilet tissue, toothpaste, um, dental floss, bathroom cleaner. And that's why I love my chalkboard in the bathroom. My next little thing that I like, um, I wanted to put something different on the back of the toilet and I didn't know what to do and I was just kind of tired of the same old, same old. So I bought this little um, iron holder at, um, where did I get that? Hobby Lobby. And then I put some old milk jars up and then I bought some fake hydrangeas, cut them, you know, with the wire cutter and put them in my bottles. And then underneath I have like a gripper so stuff doesn't go everywhere and it doesn't move at all. Next up, that I always get a lot of questions about um, is my, what do we call them, flower boxes? And these are the things that you put like a liner in and you put flowers in and you like hang them on your fence or outside of your window. And I wanted something different, something um, that would catch people's eye. And so I thought, hey, you know what? I can put these up. And so I just drilled some holes, put the nails in, I didn't spray paint them or anything. I kept them rustic and it holds my toilet tissue, some towels at to on top, and then I have a, um, a clock in the bathroom. And you know how we are, ladies. We need a clock in the bathroom to keep time of everything that we're doing. And I don't have any of my fall decorations up here yet just because it's so warm that I don't feel like, you know, I don't feel like it's fall. So. I feel like it's still very summery. So I still have summer bath and body scents still up. And usually by this time in this little soap container, I have like fall soap or Halloween soap in there. So the next best, th next thing that I really love is my mirror. Now in here, there used to be a medicine cabinet and I hated that. And so my medicine cabinet was like big, bulky, white. It just didn't fit what I liked in my bathroom. So I went to um, Home Goods and got this, and I love it. Kind of a little vintagey, you know, a little girly, perfect. And then I put up a, um, you know, like a makeup mirror. You know how us girls are. We have to have our makeup mirror. And then it does regular viewing and big viewing for those pores, girls. Yeah. There's my sink and it's very small. I don't like it. I cannot wait to redo my bathroom. Just a small little bathroom. And in my drawers, I, they're easy to keep tidy. And the first one I have um, scissors, toenail clippers, bobby pins, um, medicine, um, tubes, fingernail polish removers and wipes, nail files, um, lip balm, this thing here. Holds little spatulas for waxing. I put those all in there. 
Okay. And then in my next drawer, you know, just some makeup. Um, and you know, I don't use all this makeup all the time, so it, you know, it's perfect when you need something a little different. And the bottom one there also is, um, that's why I like, love to buy all these little containers. I have this one, and I just have that full of pencil sharpeners. This one has um, ponytail holders, makeup brushes, and I don't use this stuff on an everyday basis, you guys. So that's why it's down in the bottom drawer. And then over here underneath my sink, um, this is an old, old um, cereal container. As you see, it's all scratched up on the inside. That's just scratches. And I, that's where I put my garbage. And then I have a bin with cleaning products in there and I'm going to the grocery store so I don't have many cleaning products. And then choppies, you know, the dog stuff is behind there in another bin. And then there's some paper towel. And usually I have in there, so there's Comet, a toilet brush, a toothbrush for getting around the sink. There is a little sponge in there. And usually I have like shower cleaner and Windex or whatever I have to clean the glass. And that's it for my little bathroom tour, guys. There's my shower curtains all the way up at the top. And then there's my toilet paper and towel and clock holder. Thanks, you guys. I hope you had a good time viewing the special things I like in my real small bathroom. Okay, you guys, so I'm gonna show you just a few things that I got from Bath and & Body and um, Starbucks and Kowalski's that I picked up on Tuesday after work. So in this bag, I thought I showed you guys these before, but I guess I didn't. Um, look at the glitters already all over my hand. These are magnets. Aren't those pretty? I love them. And one side they're real glittery. You can see they've got a magnet on one side. These were, let's see, three ninety five, but um, they had, you know, like if you spend so much, you get so much off. So I got those. Those are my free gift. I got. One of them is leaking. Ah. So they had the buy five for 23 and I got three of the cocoa and hot cocoa and cream and two of the leaves. And you know, these were five for 23. One of them is leaking. I can smell it and it's all in my bag oh yeah it's all over my see it's all over my bedding it smells great it's just making a mess on my bedding and see it's on the candle and I got this for one of my girlfriends at work she kept on begging me. in my last video she heard me say if I'm burning the um one of my candles and I got it for her, but I didn't pull that one out. So let's see which one this is. This is the Cider cider Lane. It smells like um, hot apple cider on a cool day. Oh, that's nice. All right. And this one is the blueberry maple pancake. That's the one my girlfriend wanted. And it's also a three wick. These burn a little faster than Yankees. Yankees last a long time. And that reminds me, I do have to get to Yankee um, sometime this week because I heard that their chocolate chip, um, excuse me, not their chocolate chip, but their chocolate cake candle is on the retire 
shelf. Like, it's really tiring, that scent. Um, I hope not. That's one of my favorite scents. So then, let's go into my Starbucks bag here. And if you follow me on Instagram, I kind of showed these a little bit. But they have these um, Peace Love Coffee, the black Starbucks ones. And there is the Starbucks emblem on the bottom. And then it comes with the cover. And I just took this out of the bag, so it's a little dusty yet. And the same, you know, logo and stuff on the back. Just like if you're ordering. And it's also the reusable, the hard plastic ones. And I got two of those. And I got these at the Kowalski's in Woodbury. Um, the Starbucks there. Same thing on the back. And then I just got um, a couple things at Kowalski's. So I got the Mrs. Myers. I got a glare here. Yeah. The Mrs. Myers Apple. You can kind of see it. Apple scent hand soap that will go on my kitchen. There we go. And then I just got some deodorant. Um, and I'm gonna order the Mrs. Myers, you know, counter cleaner and all-purpose cleaner. I'm gonna order the apple cider and the um pumpkin. So I'll let you know when those come in and we'll look at that stuff when it comes in.